Andrew McFarlane here, and today I want to talk to you about how to not take things personally. We hear this a lot, and uh, I want to share some insights on this that have really supported me in my life in a really significant way. Okay, so first off, how do we not take things personally? This can be seen as an experience as maybe the simplest thing and maybe even one of the most challenging things that we do. So first we have to realize that nothing is personal. Realize that people can only give you what they have. If you are an angry person, anger just comes out of you. You give the world anger. If you are a joyous person, joy comes out of you. You give the world joy. If you're a loving person, love comes out of you. It has nothing to do with you. People just give you what they have. Um, something that I also want to point out in this conversation is that oftentimes when we talk about not taking things personally, we really talk about it in uh, and focus on the negative aspect. We say that if someone is criticizing you or someone does something uh, harmful towards you, don't take that personally. But I also want us to look at what we deem as the positive dimension of uh, that shows up really in, in the form of acknowledgement, positive acknowledgement, compliments, all of these things. So someone says, oh, you're so smart, and you take that personally. You, 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 you deem in your mind it's worthy of taking those things personally, so that might make you feel a little bit more confident, right? Whatever somebody says to you, and, and it doesn't mean that someone's intentions are wrong, no, but we have to also realize that if there is a shift internally where we start to have a new perspective on ourselves based on someone else's feedback, we are also susceptible and vulnerable to the opposite, right? So someone comes and says, oh my God, you're so smart, you're so wise, you're so loving, you're so everything. And then six months later, you don't do what they want you to do and they turn and they say, oh, I thought you were so nice, I thought you were so smart, I thought you were so loving, you know, you're an evil person and you get all disoriented and, and, and distorted inside. But really where that started was not when they started to criticize you, it was when they were complimenting you because you took that personally. But realize that before and after an acknowledgement or a criticism or a compliment, you're the same. You didn't change. Someone saying that you were smart didn't make you smart. Someone saying that you're beautiful didn't make you beautiful. You were the same before and after. So stay in your center. Um, you know, you can receive the intention, receive the love if people are complimenting you, but just realize inside that you are who you are and uh, you're, you're at peace with yourself. And, and that's really what matters. And I also want to make sure that we don't take this conversation out of context either. Uh, if someone is giving us feedback, doesn't mean that we should just throw everything out. Don't throw the baby out with the bathwater, as they say. Don't throw everything out the window. Process it. Receive it. Acknowledge if there's something for you in some constructive feedback about your character or how you're showing up in the world, run it through and say, okay, yeah, I can see that. Yeah, I could work on being maybe a little bit more patient, a little bit more peaceful. Whatever it is, um, but at the same time, you stay centered and you and you know where it's coming from, and you decide to to move from that centered place and decide how you're how you're going to respond to that from a very conscious and and lucid place. So as always, that's it for today. Sending you my love, Andrew McFarlane. Signing out. If you like the video, feel free to hit the like button. If you want to share it, uh, if you find that it's going to be supportive to someone that you know, please go ahead and share it. And if you're on YouTube and you want to subscribe, you can subscribe to the channel. All right, I'll see you guys soon. Peace.